Hello, and welcome to this video. I am Matt Trans Jones, also known as D365 Geek, and today we are talking about the new preview features for Dynamics 365 customer engagement coming in October. Now, we can already access some of these features in the preview so that uh, we can get a grasp on how these features work, how we deploy them, and if you want to turn them on when it gets to October and they're available in the general release. So we're going to go through how to enable this right now and you can start playing around with all the new cool features. So I am in the uh, Power Platform Admin Center. Uh, the URL for this is admin.powerplatform.microsoft.com and this is where we turn on these features. This is a demo environment that I've got at the moment, so we have these demo names of Contoso. So I'm just going to select this first Contoso environment, which is a production environment, but ideally you want to be doing these in your sandbox environments before um, October when they'll be pushed out into general availability. So we'll choose Contoso. And on the right here, we have this updates pane and it says that 2019 release wave 2 is currently off. So what we want to do is we click on manage and we get this pop up here. So uh, 2019 release wave 2, you can update now and get, and get the new features that are coming to these services. Now there is a big warning down here and this is something that we should all be aware of is that you can't undo this. So once we click this update button, it will update and there is no way to undo this. So only do this if you are certain you want to turn these features on. And again, you should be doing this in your sandbox environments. So we'll click update now. Turn on update. Um, so again, uh, we're getting a prompt here to say what we want to do uh, and why and just to sort of double check that we want to do this so we're just going to enter the name of our environment and our environment name is Contoso uh, but in your instance it would be whatever the name of your environment is and click confirm and then we wait so as we can see, uh, this now says activate in here, and all we need to do is just wait until this is fully activated, and then we can use the features in the main uh, the main system. So that's as simple as it is. Um, all you need to do come into the Power Platform Admin Center, turn them on in this pane here, and then you can start uh, using all the new features, turn them on in your sandbox, and um, having a play around with them. So. Hope you guys like this video. If you do, like and subscribe to my channel. Um, are you turning on this preview? Uh, what features are you looking forward to in October? Answer in the comments and I'll see you next time.